Use a 24 and 30 millimeter wrench or socket to remove the ball joint nuts. You will also need an 8 millimeter Allen bit to keep the ball joint stud from rotating if it breaks free. Use a suitable puller to separate the steering knuckle from the axle housing. Remove the lower ball joint snap rings. Be sure to clean thoroughly around both upper and lower ball joints so you don't damage the ball joint removal tools. TS1082 ball joint press set will remove ball joints from 2003 to 2013 AAM front axles. If the ball joints are kind of stuck in the C yokes, you can use a small hammer to help loosen them. Use a pick to take off the lower ball joint boot before removing the lower ball joint. Be sure the anvil is centered in the ball joint before pressing the ball joint out. Be sure the axle is clean before installing new ball joints. Use Toolset TS1082 to install new ball joints. Note the lower ball joint anvil has a smooth face. You may notice we are reusing original ball joints for this video. Typically when ball joints are removed, they will not be reused. Use QK4586 ball joint kit, which contains all parts required for ball joint service. Pro tip. The lower ball joint seal should be removed so the installer tool does not crush it. Once the ball joint is seated, tap the axle with a hammer and tighten the press a bit more to ensure the joint is correctly installed. The lower ball joint removal tool can be used to press on the new ball joint seal.
Now install the lower ball joint snap ring. Now install the upper ball joint. Note the anvil for this has a step machined in the face so it contours the axle profile. 